hello everyone welcome back to my channel today i would like to show you guys how to generate the CSR using the open SSN software before i get started i would like to share you some prerequisites to generate the CSR using the open SSN first of all you have to make sure open SSN install on your window machine if you haven't done yet for the for the installation of the open SSL you can go and check in my youtube channel there's another separate video to for the installation of the open ssn for the second you have to create for the configuration file also known as like .cnf file and then including the uh, proper parameters like uh, certificate uh, name and then as well as like, like uh, private key parameter and uh, country and etc etc once your config is ready, we will use the uh, specific OpenSSN command to generate the CSR. As a last step, after you generate the CSR, you have to submit the CSR to sign by the, your certificate authority server. Okay, we have four steps. So for me, I already have the OpenSSN in my window computer. Let me check. All right, here you go. Okay, I already have installed for the OpenSSN in my window machine. For the second, we have to create the uh, configuration file, also known as like dossier file. For so for the dossier file, I already have uh, created in my drive D. Sorry, here you go so this is the folder part my pc drive d and then i create that one of the folder as a, like a open ssn then i already have the open ssn.cnf what are the inside let me show you as well here you go so i create the default site as a 4096 big and then the uh, private key as well as like a uh, distinguished name so this required distinguished name linked to here then i have a common name example like server1.swaver.net and then uh, country name as well country name i use the united states us then i have a state and then as well as like uh, locality and then this is like a department name oh sorry this is like a organization name then this is like a department name so i have uh, a lot of value here so for you if you have like uh, more data you can uh, add in uh, 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 some of the information as well in here the main objective theme is like subject alternative name is important so even though i have one server i put a uh, server one dot cyber.net, server2.cyber.net, server3.cyber.net so and the one certificate I will have three domain name as well and then I want to put like IP address as well here so this is my configuration data uh, inside the uh, uh, openssn.cnf file so this is uh, the second step okay so then I have to prepare for the openssn command to generate the CSR okay i have some command to generate for the csr generation so step one i will generate the csr using the open ssn so this is the command okay so i have to point here this is my open ssn csr csr for the part okay so let me go back again you see this dry d open ssn dot csr so this is the, the, the folder part I will export out for the server1.csr as a file name. Then the key I will request like a 4096 with the RSA. Then private key also I will export out under the same folder. Do ID, open SSN, CSR. Then my private key name is private.key. Then I will point to the config file. The config file is here open ssn.cnf all right so this is the first step i need to generate okay 
let me copy this I will go back to the CLI okay okay I will paste here here we go it will ask you the common name depends on the your configuration file example in my case I configure as a server one dot server dot net click enter in this case it will ask you depends on your configuration file in my case as a US okay so I will compare this US in my case uh, the CD name is like in New York okay and why okay my company name like a server neck and then this is like a organization unique it's like a department network security application as well as like uh, any other like the data you can put it that's all okay so everything is already generated let's go back again okay the second step this is uh, like a verification step in my case all right so copy this then we go and paste it here the name is server so windows csr in my case here we go okay here we can check the uh, uh all the data uh, such as like a uh, common name gantry state locality and then the permit etc etc so we can verify from here using this command and then uh, another team is like as well as like subject alternated name server one two three and then as well as like ip address as well so it means uh, we have to set for the um just a generation and then as well as like we can check for the uh, private key okay in my case uh, i use uh, the name as a private dot key so let's go and copy this here we go check here okay all right so here we go we can check the uh, private key as well we have uh, uh, all the data here so so okay uh, so we have uh, already verified that the uh, CSR and then as well as like private key so next step uh, the last step as uh, um, signing the, the, the CSR to the uh, uh, certificate authority server we are ready to sign our CSR uh, into our certificate authority server so uh in here you have to think like uh, you have to think about the uh, uh certificate authority server so it will be uh, uh 2k uh, it will be like uh internet internet ce or public ce okay so uh internet ce means uh, you have for uh, internet own ce uh public ce means example like godaddy uh, those kind of like uh, public certificate sign CA so you have to sign uh, from the uh, public uh, in my case I'm using the um, uh, internet CA server I have it okay okay here we go uh, this is mine the uh, internet CA server okay uh, let's go and the uh, generate the uh, certificate so okay let's go and check here okay here we go I have uh, a private key here I have CSR here so I will open it uh, okay copy everything okay let, copy then let's go back to the uh, certificate server request a certificate advanced request advanced certificate request in my case I'm using the internet here that's why I can go and access directly to my server so case here okay here we go this is certificate request uh, then you have to choose the certificate template is like a web server in my case because i would like to sign uh, this uh, certificate in my server one that's why i choose the uh, web server submit okay let's work a while So if you're using the uh, internet CA in your case, uh, you have to submit to your assistant team in the production. Okay, uh, here we go. I will choose the base 64 certificate, download certificate, and then as well as like I can download the certificate chain as well. Okay, here we go. Yes, okay, all right. 
So um, let me double check in. Open it. Here we go. Okay, let's go and compare it uh, with the our data. Okay. Okay, here you see uh, common name is the server when dot shiba.net this one then signed by my certificate internet is server this one this is my uh server this is my the uh, uh certificate authority server so let's go and check the details this is certificate serial number then who is issuer issuer is this one issued by this ca okay okay here we go this is all the data whatever you put inside the open SSN uh, CNF file example like uh, OU organization unit is uh, this one okay then the rest of the data is right here okay the next thing what is important thing? okay here this is the important thing so DNS name server 123 here we go server 123 and then uh, IP address right this one download another one in my case okay so let's go and check okay so yeah i already have it the uh, certificate uh example like if i'm going to install my uh certificate into my server so i need this uh, private key as well as like uh this certificate okay so yeah so i hope uh you will get uh something uh from this uh tutorial video so this is a very quick uh, tutorial uh, to generate the CSR and then as well as like uh, a private key and then sign by the uh, my internet CA in my case. So yeah, um, uh, I hope uh, you will get something from my YouTube channel uh, for this video. Uh, of if you want to know like uh, if you want to get some of the uh, very quick tutorial knowledge in future, you can subscribe my uh, YouTube channel. Thank you for today.